the 90s for me was just working, trying to make ends meet. Um, there used to be a McDonald's commercial that said, you wake up, go to work, go home, go to bed. Wake up, go to work, go home, go to bed. I felt like that's what it was for me from the 90s. I was buying some patterns though. At least I have a lot of patterns from the 90s. Hey, 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 it's Terry, Virginia's daughter, and I am back with my 1990s. This is a uh, Butterick 5270. Mrs. Pa petite jacket, skirt, and pants. This is really, really cute. I don't think Virginia ever made this. Let's see. Yep, it's uncut. I'll sell it. This is McCall's, the Easy McCall's 9125, Daphne Maxwell Reed. I don't know if you remember her. She became the second Aunt Viv. unlined jacket, tunic in two links, pull on pants, skirt, scarf, and hat. Oh, the hat isn't, okay, I see you with the hat. I am going to sell this. And then we have McCall's 9102. I know that I bought this pattern right out. I don't think I ever made it. It's a Mrs. Dress, pullover loose fitting dress with princess seams, has longer short sleeves, back belt detail, and side seam pockets. I will check to see if this is uncut. It looks like it has been cut, but it looks like the pieces are intact. So this is 8, 10, 12, 8, 10, 12, yes. I'll double check. This would be a first sell. And then if it's not, you know, sell worthy, then I would just donate it. I think it's very cute, but I just, it's not my style anymore. And then we have McCall's 9078. I'm gonna hate to part with this pattern. I really am. It's um, Mrs. Dress in two links. I know Virginia had one of these as well. And at one point I had all of her patterns separated. So all of the patterns that we bought alike, I had them separated, but I think I may have just donated them. You know what I mean? So there were only certain ones that I kept. I don't even know why, but I know she had this one because we bought this one together. So this one is not my size. So let's see. <laughs> let's see what the measurements are. It is rayon, rayon blend, soft crepe. Okay. For a size 10. Bust 32, waist 25, hip 34 and a half. Yeah. Terry can't do anything with that. This should be uncut. Yep, factory folded and uncut. I will sell this one. Someone should be happy to buy that. We are really winding up here, yeah. It's so easy, Simplicity 8467, extra small through XL. And it's just a Mrs. Jacket out of fleece. I'll donate this. Well, let's see. Um, 8467. Oh, is everything in here? Now, the only thing I have here are the instructions. So, Simplicity 8467. I'll have to see if I can find that. I'm just going to put this off to the side because I need to get the envelope for that. So here's McCall's 9175, I do not love anymore. It's a Mrs. Line jacket, top pants and skirt in two lengths. Or do I? I've never cut this, I bought this myself. This is my pattern. I feel like uh, Virginia had this one too, but this is really cute, yeah. Yeah, I'll keep this on <laughs> second thought. You look at the line drawings and you're like, ah, yeah, I like that. So it's got princess seams in the jacket. It looks like the sleeve is in two pieces. It has a nice shirt, so yeah, nice pair of pants. Which one is the keep, which one is the sale? Okay, the keep is the one furthest away from me, okay. Ah, uh, we have another New York collection. I'm keeping this. This is a dress and slip dress, both in two links. This is a slip dress, but it has a like a midriff band. I think this is so cute. And I can tell you it's probably uncut. I hadn't cut into any of that. Here is Butterwick, 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 Butterwick. Nine, so easy. 
These are skirts. <sighs> you know, Butterick 5488. Uh, Miss, Mrs. Petite Skirt and Skorts. Oh, I didn't realize that. Mm. 18, 20, 22. Okay, so I think this is gonna be a donate. I know for sure that I did not cut this. Now, I don't know if I bought this for me or if I bought it for my niece. I think I bought this for her. She and I went to the fabric store one time and I think she picked this out. I'm gonna sell this. And then we have two quick sew patterns. Now, one of the quick sew patterns, I know that I've used this. Wait a second. Yes. So I won some fabric from Fabric Mart, I think it was. And I made this top out of. So this is quick sew. 2759 it's a mrs cardigan and camisole so the instructions are here and because i used it right i was not in the habit of tracing so i cut the extra large so the pattern sizes are still intact but if i use this again i would trace the pattern i got this from ohio thrift so i'm going to keep this one i love this i got this at the thrift store too this is another quick sew pattern, 2742. It's a Mrs. Coat. Designed for medium to heavy weight woven fabrics. Okay then. So I will definitely be keeping this. And it's, I can tell you, it just, it feels like this has never been cut. I mean, look at this, this is perfect. Now this says Butterick 5465, which is really, really cute, but I don't see an envelope for it. So I'm gonna put it here. So far I have a few patterns here that I don't see envelopes for. This says Butterick 5465 pants only. Let me drop this stuff. Look at me drop this stuff. Why did I pull this out? Oh, so that's this one. Oh, that's this one. Oh, these are cute though. They have a drawstring waist. Oh, this is six, eight, ten. So I eh, pants are easy enough to. This is pants only. Yeah, I'll pitch it. I have one pitch. I'll just throw this away. It's not a complete pattern, so why even bother? Ah, uh, this is a retro Butterick, nineteen forty-eight. Mrs. Cape and Capelet. Um, I'll be selling this one. This is from Virginia Stash, I'm sure it is, but it's just, I, I can't use the size, so I knew it was gonna be uncut. This is really cute. And then we have McCall's 2149. I think I bought this pattern. It's a men's shirt, and it's nice that it's uncut, so I can sell this. And the last pattern of the 1990s is this vintage original 1943 design by Vogue. Just love it. Look at all those details. This is really cute, but I won't keep it. I'll sell this and I know I haven't cut this. Out of all of these, I have one that I'm gonna pitch. Five donate. And now for the sell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. 47, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. So 42 patterns that I'm going to try to sell. To keep, let's see how much to keep. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, 
Okay, 37. So I think that's that. Let me let me do a double check and I'll be right back. So I have four patterns here that I cannot find the contents contents for that I'll be trying to locate those. So that's it for the 1990s. Look at how many patterns I'm able to rearrange. So the cell patterns will be in a different place. Of course, I will be housing them until I sell them. The donate the pitch, the patterns that I get to go back in my drawer. So I am happy about what I've got accomplished here. Thank you so much for joining me. Remember, if you have any patterns that you're trying to purge, you can follow with me. We can do all of this together. And until next time, take care. <laughs>